Good morning. Today is going to be a pretty big migration day, so I'm going out in the kayak. Got uh, a dozen mallard decoys, got a dozen teal decoys, just because they're small. Figured they'd work really well, and I also got a dozen of these uh, honker decoys. So I think we're in for a treat here today. We got a 20 mile an hour north wind. It's kind of snowing, raining, sleeting, and uh, it's going to be a good day out in the kayak. It's going to be cold, but um, game plan here is just shoot six ducks and get back home as quick as I can. It's going to feel like nine degrees today with the wind chill, so got to be careful. Got to be really, really careful out here on the water, especially with these high wind situations in a kayak. I've done it before. I'm going to a spot that I've hunted before, so nothing too scary out there. Just a little bit of wind, a little bit of raininess going on, so I think, I think it'll be a good day. I really do. I think this uh, strong wind and the weather and the cold, we're going to have ducks, and I think they're going to be all over us. That's about it. So we're going to get loaded up here, finish, finish getting everything loaded up, and paddle out to the spot and get things set up, and I'll check back in with you guys before shooting light. All right, we're set up and ready to go. Quack Yak is looking pretty good, and we got all the decoys out in the water. Y'all probably can't even see them, but I'm sitting back here thinking, man, I probably set them a little too close to the bank, but it is what it is. I'm thinking there's some trees and stuff like right here that I might post up in and just hunt from there instead of in the kayak. At least at first light when these ducks can't really see. And then when the, when the sun starts coming up, then I'll probably tuck back in the kayak and get a little bit more concealed. But I think it'd be really good to just stand here and uh, shoot whatever ducks come in at first light because they'll probably have a hard time seeing me if I'm tucked up against some of these trees. It's going to be a good day. we got a stiff wind and... It's kind of snowing a little bit. This is a migration day if I've ever seen one. So it'll be good. It'll be good. Not as cold as I thought it was going to be, but maybe it's just because I've been up and moving around all day. So we'll see what happens when I sit down in the blind. But we'll get after it here. Hopefully, we can shoot some ducks today. There we go. It's a nice start to the day. Oh, Susie Q. Come on, I'm on the deck. Landed short. Those jerks. There we go. We got a uh, Susie. I'm not gonna bend over. She's right there. Looking pretty. I'm gonna put the camera up. We got a bunch of ducks coming in right now. Right this second. Right now. Oh my gosh, that's a big group. Let's go. Oh, Mr. Greenhead, how you doing? Oh, I love Miss Susie Q. All right, now I gotta be careful. Whew. I'm a freaking Susie Slayer today. Shot my two mallard hens, so uh, gotta be careful. There's my two two Susies there. We got a big old fat greenhead right here. Look at that freaking mallards, bro. Look at that. 
I love these birds. This cold front is not disappointing me today. All I know is the paddle out might be a little bit rough. Going to paddle out and get those birds kind of sucks. That wind really catches the kayak, especially with the blind on it. So, you gotta be careful. But we got we got tons of ducks and uh, big groups of mallards working in right low on the deck, just like I like them. So, you can't ask for anything more than this. What a beautiful day. Gosh, I just put the camera up. We got a group coming in. Ah, <laughs> oh, got one. I think I was just behind that second one. Clipped him a little bit. Not enough to bring him down. Ain't nothing prettier than bringing his. What a beaut. Gorgeous birds. Oh my gosh, yesterday when I scouted, I saw four ducks. We gotta push. Freaking mallards. I love these ducks. I really do. I love how they work. I love how to call them. Just, they are by far, bar none, the best duck out there. In my personal opinion. I like them a lot. Oh my gosh, there's a duck cupping in right now. This is a green head. I'm going to shoot. I flared off. All right, we just need one more green head and we're out of here. Quick limit. Don't have to sit out in the cold for too long. Perfect. Here comes a couple of steel. <laughs> that might have been my shot. <laughs> There's my mallard limit. Right there. I don't know how I missed that first shot, but maybe I was just a bit excited. Let's go pick him up. This is a site that every duck hunter loves. Just paddling your kayak up to a mallard drake. Woo! What more could you possibly want? Woo! Yeah. Pooping? I don't know what's coming out of your butt, dude. And there we go. We got the first mallard limit of the year. Got three greenies and two Susies. Oh, it's full of ducks right there. That's what I'm talking about. Look at that. Whew. So two Susies. Whoops. And three greenheads. What a freaking day. It's just getting colder and colder as the day goes on. And I'm so stoked to be limited out by like 8.30. You couldn't have asked for anything better. Wow. Shooting was okay today. It wasn't rough. Um, got a little excited so I missed some shots, but that's kind of how it goes. But it's time to get all the decoys picked up. It's going to be a cold one, so I'll meet, meet you guys back 
at the house or the truck whenever I feel like picking the camera up. It's always a good day when you are limited out, loaded up in the truck, and it's 8.48 in the morning. What an awesome morning. Got my mallard limit. I just, I, I decided to not try and stick around for my bonus duck. I kind of lost a couple chances for some bonus ducks early on, so it is what it is. The storm's kind of coming in. I'm trying to get home before the roads get too bad, so not too bad of a day. It's nice green heads. This is the first green head limit of the year, so that's pretty sweet. Uh, well, mallard limit. I shot two hens. That's my bad. Whatever. They all eat the same. I hope we can get some more of these. I really do. And I think with this push, the ducks will be here. It's usually about this time of year when they start really showing up. So I'm excited. I think things are going to go very well this season. If this trend keeps coming. One cold front a week. Um, I'm really happy that I decided to go out this morning. Yesterday I scouted, saw four ducks, but I saw there was a cold front coming in and I was like, you know, I gotta get out and go. There's a cold front, there's gonna be fresh birds, and they're gonna be here. What should we wear? What an awesome way to spend a morning. I'm so glad I got out of bed this morning. Got the first mallard limit of the season with this nice little cold front that came through. And I think this is just the first of many mallard limits this season. I'm, I've, been, I've been struggling a little bit trying to find some birds, but I think we're finally getting a nice cold front to push some in. I mean, all I saw today was I saw some bluebills, and I saw some teal, not very many teal, and mallards. So, you know, I, I think it's just kind of getting to the point now where we're getting that push. We're finally getting into the heat of the season, and things are really going to take off from here. So I shot 10 shells for 5 ducks, 50%. That's not too shabby. Um, I was getting excited. I was just flat out just excited to see mallards working into the decoys and I would just miss. I just get excited and that's just something that happens to me all the time, especially like really early in the season, especially with mallards. I just, something about it, it just gets me all excited and I just lose my focus or something. If you guys like this hoodie, there's a link for it in the description. So be sure to head over to the website, check that out, pick it up. I also got these cryptic hats, Max 5 hats and all the Mallards Bro gear. So go ahead and check that out. If you wanna follow me on my social media, I've got Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and Facebook. So be sure to follow me on there and stay up to date with what's going on. But that is all I got for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed today's video, and I will catch you guys on the next one.